Hey, it's Brendan from acetennisonline.com. Now in this video, I'm gonna show you a simple tip to accomplish three great goals. Goal number one, miss less shots than it. Goal number two, prevent your opponent from going on offense. And goal number three, force more mistakes. Now I'm gonna play this, uh, this clip from the uh, 2021 Australian Open uh, match between Nick Kyrgios and Dominic Thiem. Now this is an excellent footage and I love the angle because you can really see how high the professionals are hitting the ball over the net. Every time I ask, especially recreational players, and I ask them how high they think the professionals are hitting above the net, most of the time they'll, they'll answer a few inches above the net. But that really isn't the case. So let's take a look at, at the, first, the first shot in the rally. Now even the, even the this is the second serve, and even that serve, is clearing that ball by a pretty safe margin. So if that's the ball, as you can see, there's a pretty good margin between the net and the ball. Now that's pretty good. And now let's take a look at that first rally shot though. So I told you that goal number one is to try and miss less in the net. So goal number one for us is really to try and take the net out of play. Okay, so in tennis, you can miss the shot by hitting it in the net, you can miss the shot by hitting it wide to one side. You can miss by hitting wide to the other side, or you can miss by hitting that ball deep. Okay, so by actually hitting higher or aiming higher over the net, we're going to make less mistakes in the net. So now we're actually taking one out of those four ways out of play. Oops. So now we can miss the side, we can miss wide, or we can miss deep. So now we're taking one out of those ways away and we're just cutting down our own mistakes by taking the net out of play. All right, now goal number two is to try and actually prevent our opponent from going on offense. So Nick Kyrgios here, he hit a very good second serve and as you can see, he's actually inside the court, so he's actually looking for a shorter or weaker return that he can attack. However, now I want you to take a look at the shot that Dominic team hits and roughly here when it crosses the net, take a look at the height of the ball. So from here to the net, now that doesn't look like a whole lot. Oh, let me get, let me straighten that line out a little bit. Okay, now that doesn't look a whole lot, but let's take a look. Now we know the net is roughly three feet in the center and that's pretty close to the center. And actually I think the green line looks a little bit longer. So we know the ball's crossing the net at least three feet above the net roughly. And if I tell most people, hey, hit three feet above the net, they'll be like, whoa, coach, you're crazy. Maybe, but if you aim higher over the net, you're going to take the net out of play because you're gonna make less mistakes and you're gonna hit deeper shots which in this case, I want you to take a look at where exactly Kyrgios is making contact. Now this shot isn't actually too deep, but because he had high over the net, that ball is gonna have a higher bounce and team is using a lot of topspin. So Kyrgios really isn't able to attack this next shot. As you can see, he's actually hitting that ball off the outside foot here and his weight is going more towards the side. So it's a tough shot to be aggressive on. So he accomplished his goal, the first goal, which is he didn't miss in the net. He accomplished his second goal, which is ma making sure you're preventing your opponent from going on offense. So let's see if he accomplishes his third goal. Now in this, in this rally, in this point, he does not. But I'll give you a little tip on that third point. If you consistently aim higher over the net and get more depth on your shot, you will win more um, uh, points by forcing more mistakes. According to Craig O'Shaughnessy, Novak Djokovic's former strategy coach, depth is the number one way to make your opponent miss. So depth is consistently the number one way you can force mistakes from your opponent. So make sure that you keep aiming higher over that net to consistently try to force more of those mistakes. Okay, so again, he's done all those, even, even on this shot, Nick Kyrgios, when he's a little bit more in a neutral position, he's able to, to get that ball with a good amount of depth, but then TM just hits a very, very solid shot up the line. And even when he's trying to be more aggressive, he's still hitting above that net. Now, if you gain any value so far, make sure to smash that like button. Now to sum up the great tips in this video, 
The tip really is to aim higher over the net to accomplish our three goals. Goal number one, take the net out of play and you won't miss in the net. Goal number two, with more depth, you're able to prevent your opponent from going on offense. And tip number three, by consistently hitting with more depth, you're going to force more mistakes from your opponent. Now, if you keep applying those tips, you're going to win more points without a doubt. You're going to start dominating those singles matches more and more, and you're going to play a much more confident game of tennis. Now, be sure to check out more of those coaching videos. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And share this video with a friend or a teammate, because that's an excellent way to help support this channel. Now, thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next coaching video.